I'm Jan from Australia. A massage therapist by trade since the early 90s. I met Mike at a triathlon. He kind of struggled the last part of the race. He told me he was running around in circles. And so we were all sitting around talking after the race. I couldn't move. I kept cramping. I offered to do some work on him. And there were a couple of other people there that did ART as well. So anyway, I worked on him a little bit. was able to be a little bit more comfortable. Suggested that I might like to do ART. And that was my beginning. One of the most inspirational things about doing ART just makes you want to be better at what you do and makes you ask questions and help people. Do a really crash course in anatomy. Most people that do massage therapy don't have a really good background in anatomy. When I first started doing ART, I got myself into as many wet labs as I could. I did a lot of courses. It was really exciting to be in a lab looking at cadavers. <laughs> the fact that there's movement involved in when you're working on people, it's not compressive. So when you do massage therapy, you're basically told to compress a muscle. And the more pain you cause somebody, the better it is. But with the movement, you can actually do quite a bit of tension on a muscle and be even more effective in terms of shortening and lengthening the muscle than being very compressive. So it makes a huge difference. Stop procrastinating. Do it. Do it. Thank you.